Christian, it's just in your in your heart to minister. You want to go and, and bless people. And, and the first place I ministered, probably one of the first places, was at a nursing home. with God. 
that share his very heart. There are different versions. This is from the message. So it's it helps you look at things from a different perspective. It's very raw. Um, it's it's putting your heart out there and in front of people and you know showing them who you are. That's that's part of what I think is so good about God is that He's real to us. He sees us and accepts us where we are. Um, Yeah. 
focus on your promise when I wait on you shut out the noise listen to what you tell me I get fresh church is called the vineyard the church we go to and that's music is one of the things that the vineyard is known for a lot of people from different different churches would sing vineyard music because it were there were simple there were heartfelt songs that really uh that really spoke to people and in all walks you know really all different types of people loved it my Jesus, I love thee. I know thou art mine. For thee all the follies of sin I resign. My gracious Redeemer, my Savior. 
your love keeps my heart like a home. It perfects me on and on. In far places, through the ages, my story will tell of a father whose love never fails.
things right and bless your name. All things made right and new again. Let all things rise and bless your name. All things made right and new again. more than we can ever imagine. 
you know, what do you, when I hear promises of wonder, there's two different, at least two different things that I can think of with that. You might have some other insights. One of them is we don't know what God's going to do next. I wonder what's going to come next. We don't know, but we know that God has wonderful things in store for us. We wonder, because we don't know, but we know God is faithful and God is good. God always does something wonderful, ultimately. And it's hard sometimes, but I want you to remember when things get tough, God's making a wonderful thing, a beautiful thing out of your life. Because you are precious and deeply loved. And as Bart said, you are God's precious child, every one of you. So would you pray with me? Lord Jesus, thank you that you are our home. Our home is in you. There's stuff that happens in our lives that's hard, God, and we we confess that. Our bodies hurt. Our minds forget. Things happen. Life is hard sometimes. But Lord, you take every single piece of our lives and you make it beautiful. And you wrap us up in your love and you say, I love you. I am here. And all you ask of us is to to say back to you, here I am. And Lord, you embrace us. So would you help us today to walk in the promises of wonder, to fall into your embrace to love you and to love ourselves and to love others the way that you love us. Your love is perfect and never ends. So as we begin autumn tomorrow, would you help us as we see every piece of color, as we feel the coolness, and as we see every leaf fall to the ground, would each one of these be a reminder to each one of us of how deeply loved we are by you and just give that love away. And we pray for your blessing, every blessing under heaven for everyone who's here. And we just thank you and praise you for the gift of music. Thank you for Bart. Thank you for each one here. And we pray these things in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. The first day of autumn is special for me every year. Uh, It's my birthday. (laughs) Birthday.